Seville, a garden in Queens. What do you got? I got a taste of El Salvador as I walked through a cornfield in Flushing, Queens. Miguel Martinez, manager at Smart Car Wash, came to New York from El Salvador four years ago. He fled his country because of gangs, violence, and lack of work opportunities. The gang was somebody, just somebody there, they no good. Yeah? Yeah. A lot of violence? Yeah. Okay. Um, a lot of gangs, a lot of violence, a lot of drugs? Yeah, yeah. So he was very happy to be at the Smart Car Wash, but he really missed his homeland, specifically the fresh vegetables that his parents used to grow in the area. He showed me some pictures of his parents' home, and you see plenty of green everywhere. There's corn, there's plenty of exotic fruits from the area, and he really wanted to bring that to New York. He started planting fresh vegetables right in front of the core wash on Crotcheron Avenue. Beautiful cornfield in the middle of Flushing, Queens. <laughs> That's a good for a barbecue, this yeah. ready. Look at that, looking nice. Yeah, it looks beautiful. Nice. There's even a cucumber hidden here that Miguel's showing me. That's nice and juicy. Just want a slice of that. Yeah, look at the jalapeno. This is good. Right, Very nice. Very hot. Yeah. And I asked some of the customers who came to get their cars washed how they felt about the greenery and the cornfield. It's nice to see some greenery in a, an area that's pretty much the city. Um, so it kind of brings the country life into the suburbs, which is nice. Well, I think it's kind of neat, actually. It's something different, it's, you know, in the city street, city environment. It's pretty cool, I think. Next year, he's going to grow enough to start selling. Would you buy it? Vegetables here, in addition to getting your car washed? Yeah, I would. If everything was fresh and looked good, I definitely would. No. I, I, I basically like the stores. I prefer it. I know it's safer. I don't know what's on those fields at night. <laughs> I just grew my first plant, like, ever. It's a tomato plant, and it, all the tomatoes are starting to turn red. And it is such an accomplishment when I can put those tomatoes on my dinner table that, like, I can totally understand why you want to grow your own food. He should make salsa and have, like, a little table and sell it. I'm sure he'd be happy so he can... He can Seriously, now all I'm thinking about is corn salsa. Well, he doesn't have enough to sell. You've got to wait a year, Bill. <laughs> all right, all right. Catch up with me next year. Thank you.